Welcome to the screening premiere of the art music album Eureka. Eureka is an experiment of art transformation. It is a confluence of paintings with music and a collaborative project between painter Uday Kulkarni and American artist Bart Woodstrup. The album is dedicated to M.F. Hussein. Uday Kulkarni is an eminent artist with several art exhibitions to his credit. He is a self-taught artist and has exhibited in Mumbai, New Delhi, Kolkata, Bangalore, and abroad in Singapore and London. He began his art journey with a debut exhibition at the Jahangir Art Gallery, Mumbai, in 1976. American artist Bart Woodstrup's goal is to understand and manipulate the aesthetics, semiotics, and narratives of various time-based media. This work often takes the form of traditional musical composition, real-time interactive audio-video performance, multimedia installation, and networked experience. He regularly performs live video and visual synthesis as Wodstrup and was a founding member of Pauline Oliveros' improvisational telepresence ensemble, Tintinabulate. Eureka 1, Symphony in Colors. Painting is not the imitation of nature, but to express an impression, a feeling, an emotion that we experience while involving ourselves in the beauty of nature. These are simple delights of nature. They are token of nature's rhythm harping on the inner strings of being in the emerald greens of forest, in the dark browns of soul, in the deep blues of sea, in the golden yellow of sunshine, in the roaring, soaring sea waves, the dawn, the dusk, the twilight, and the moonlit nights. Eureka 2, Call of the Rocks. 
Rocks are supposed to symbolize strength, thus the expression, the rock of the ages. Rocks are like strong and silent men. You scale rocks. They are a challenge to the spirit. You call out aloud to any who will listen. Their harshness is bracing. You have to measure up to them, but first, contemplate them in your mind's eye, the masculine beauty of them. Rocks amongst desert dunes, rocks upon which the ocean beats its might. What would the soft, yielding earth be without the hard brass of rock in its myriad guises, now gray, now rusty, now mottled? Then infinity of shapes, amazing the asymmetry. Verily, rocks are the secret of the earth. They are the clock of time. Read them as the geologist reads them. Looking down from your concrete towers only ensures your own diminishment. Eureka 3. Color Ecstasy In the latest Color Ecstasy, 
Uday Kulkarni has progressed beyond recognition with regard to maturity in concept and fascinating color sense. As the saying goes, time flows into every human the same way, but the human beings flow into it each in his or her different way. This cardinal truth has found, perhaps, its profound expression in these compositions. In his landscapes, symphony, seascape, or in works like the emotive currents such as confusion, reflection, destruction, the nostalgic interpretations like in remembrance, it is assertingly clarified that this untiring artist has left behind many milestones and is striving towards exploring the endless expanse of creative expressions defying perhaps time and tide alike. That is what is expected of an artist whose concern is only art first and art last.
Eureka 4 Ritu Chakra Spirit of the Seasons The seasons, autumn, spring, monsoon and summer, they govern our earth, they sustain the prakriti, they enrich our life, change our moods and exhilarate our spirits. Our ancestors worshipped the seasons in Rig Veda. The great Sanskrit poet Kalidas composed Ritu Samhar. Many artists painted Rag Ragini in classical Indian paintings. The seasons manifest in nature in five elements, Jal, Vayu, Agni, Dharti and Akash, the water, the wind, the fire, the earth and the sky, during the earth's cosmic journey through the space. They bring sunshine, clouds, rainfall, wind breeze and greenery on the earth. They bring the blazing sun in the summer, the purple showering clouds in the monsoon, the lunar shine in the winter, the cooled breeze and warmth of sun in the autumn, and the colorful blossom of flowers in the spring. Ritu Chakra, the cycle of seasons, moves on. A cosmic phenomenon takes place through Grishma, Varsha, Vasant, Sharad, Hemant and Shishir, appealing the exultant mood and spirit of the seasons.
Eureka 5 Echoes in the Mind The Throbbing There was movement around, but my feelings were static within. There was calm on my outside, but anxiety and throbbing within. Eureka 6 Whispers from the Nature The pastel pink, lemon, blue, green, and the bold strokes of white rendered the canvases an inviting and soothing experience. And even the fire of the forest, with its red-hot embers and flames, was balanced by using cooler paints. The lotus pond transported the viewers to the lotus-breeding secret valleys in the Himalayas, the heavenly abode of magical flora and fauna. The rhythmic play of sunlight on the emerald green leaves of oak trees and the wind blowing through their branches was the whispering nature, too. The jingling water streams flowing in the whispering nature, one, slowly transformed themselves into the huge and quiet glaciers, their softness turning into a rocky and rough but sublime purity manifesting the diving spirituality of the limitless snowy ranges. In totality, the series was an honest representation of the beauty and magic of nature.
Eureka 7, Eternity, The Cosmos. The twinkling star, named after the goddess of love, Venus, is a symbol of pure love and has relationship with man. The relationship is as turbulent as the formation of the star. This star inspired me for art, and I created the paintings series. These paintings are manifestations of universal energy of love. They are metaphysical transcendent of love from the Venus. They are celestial phenomenon. There are gaseous nebulae whirling in the cosmos. There are stellar explosions. There are splinters of tiny heavenly lights emitting in the space. There are galaxies of stars emerging and ever expanding in the Milky Way. There is eternal dance of darkness and light. Amidst the galaxy of stars, quantum of cosmic energy is released and Venus, the star of love, is born. It has mysticism and spirituality. It is a source of incessant flow of essential love energy, enlightening our consciousness, revealing that we are part of cosmic consciousness. This series is a repertoire of paintings of divinity, consciousness, spirituality, and eternity. It's my vision of stars, planets, space, cosmos, and beyond.
We now conclude the album with Pasayadan, a prayer written by Sant Nyaneshwar, vocals by Dr. Padmaja Finani Joglekar. The prayer is for peace, love, harmony, happiness, and enlightenment of all living beings in the universe. Dr. Padmaja Finani Joglekar is an eminent Hindustani classical singer. She is a disciple of Pandit Jasraj and was awarded the Padma Shri Award in 2001. And now, Dr. Padmaja Finani Joglekar. Aata Vishwatma Ke Deve Yeni Vagyatni Tusha सकळ मंगळी ईश्वर निष्ठांची मांदी आळी अनवरत भूमंडळी भेट तू भूता चला कल्पतरूंचे अरव Oh, 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 oh. 